What's up, people? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. That was terrible. That was a terrible intro. What's up, YouTube? So, my name is Pai, or Paya, and this is my wife, Aisha. So today we're going to be doing some Q&As, right? Yep. So these questions, we actually, what we did was, we picked them out ourselves, um, and we're just going to go ahead and answer them straight off the bat. Let's go. Okay, you want me to do the first question? You, you want me to do the first question? Yeah. Cool, then. Alright, man. No, this is just random, so I'm just random to select one that I like, okay? I'm gonna pick one that I like. Oh, you're gonna do random? Yeah, I'm not just gonna do it in like, oh, that's boring, nobody wants that. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> first question. Okay, here. If you didn't know me, what would you think my name would be? <laughs> um, just by looking at you. Yeah, just by looking at you. Because I'm. Because <clears throat> I think I know. Make it something like luxurious and amazing. Your name would be. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what? I don't know why. For some reason, the only name that pops up in my head. <laughs> Is Jason? <laughs> Jason? What the heck? I don't know why. Jason. I think it's only because I'm thinking about how much your personality matches with Jason Mendoza. From the place. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't know why. I don't think that name suits your your face though, but that doesn't sound like serious at all. Like, it just sound it's like just something fancy. that just it just popped up in my head. Alright. Where did we meet? Uh, yeah. You know what? Actually, yeah. we met on social media. It was a social media site. You're not gonna say no, which one? No, because it's, it's not even not even that important. But let's just say it was on media and it wasn't Tinder. Yeah, no, it wasn't Tinder. No, no. <laughs> um, so what happened was I was actually um, on the site. Well, not site, but the app it was actually an app. And he was famous on that app. Yeah, I was actually I was pretty famous on that. I think I had like how much did I have? I don't know, something. Two hundred and forty-one thousand. Yeah. Something followers. I don't know. But anyway, so what happened was, um, I ended up seeing one of her videos, and I liked it, and so I just come dropped a little comment or video, you know, slide to them, slide to DMs, you know, and uh, next thing you know. I got a job, I ended up saving up money, then I ended up flying out to the UK, which is actually where she was from. I didn't know that in the beginning. And I stayed with her for about two weeks, and it was the best two weeks of my life, honestly. It was great. So, yeah. Um, maybe we might mention, do you want to say what it was? Uh, maybe later on. <laughs> yeah. If yeah, you guys was, ask us, yeah, if you have, a lot, if you if ask we us. get like a lot of comments asking us which social media site it was. I guess then, yeah, then we'll have to review yeah, it. Yeah, then we're gonna have to say. But right now, yeah. I just keep it yeah. kind of cringy, you know. Give me that. Okay. Describe me three words. <laughs> um, describe you in three words. Yeah, go on. Go just on. from my point. In point of view yeah okay I would say to me you're very attractive okay so that's one okay. lazy no 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 yeah when okay. you, you want to be part, no okay. it's my turn to talk right now when you want to be lazy I mean when you want to be productive you can be very productive yeah but if somebody was to give you the choice you would be lazy Okay, yeah. number three, okay. so that's two. Number three is what? talented. Talented? Yeah, I think you're very talented. You have a lot of okay. talents. I guess, I, I guess that's two good ones for me then. Yeah. Okay, what would you describe me? What? No, words? we're gonna skip that one. No, 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 come on. I don't know how to do that. Yeah, you do. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> I thought we were going back and forth. Alright, alright, here, here, here. Go on. Okay. I would say angelic, cause you're so amazing. Yeah. Oh, I see you fluttering the eyes. <laughs> yeah, man. All right. Yeah. You're very angelic. You're very bossy. 
um, and you're very scary. <laughs> what the yes, heck? that's all of them right there. <laughs> scary. Scary, bossy, and angelic. So like you're like a half demon, half angel, I guess. You know. Oh, I like oh, that. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. What? Uh, what do we argue about the most? It's the second thing, second thing. The second thing, okay, okay. The second thing we argue about the most, right? I would say is the fact that I don't do anything. Sometimes. Like your laziness basically. My laziness basically. So I guess you're right on that. Like uh -huh. I would just you know, uh like for say if I needed to eat something. I would have to choose between cooking me food and just eating a bag of chips. I would probably just open the bag of chips because it's easier. Mm -hmm. Or if I needed to go upstairs and grab my wife's phone, I probably wouldn't do that. I'd probably just continue doing what I was doing because I was just like, too lazy to go up the stairs. Why did you need to grab my phone? You always ask me to grab your phone. <laughs> what the heck? You're la that has she's nothing, lazy too. She's that has, lazy too. That has nothing to do with your eating habits. You were talking about food. The oh. heck did you bring the phone into it for? I was trying to give examples, like, <laughs> I don't know. She, okay, um, but yeah, so that's, yeah, that's, that's another thing. Okay, what do you most. think we argue about the most? I mean, my reason was stupid. It was pretty stupid, but I mean, you know, in your ears. I think we argue about, we argue a lot about. <laughs> <laughs> what? Say it, man. Um. <laughs> okay, wait. I think that's it. We all no, about it's not. Laziness. There's more. Okay, there's more, but we just can't think about it. Okay, next question, go on. Okay. Give me that. Oh, Alright, my turn. Okay, so. Who said I love you first? Guy. Yeah, but you said it in a very mysterious way. Cause he said it in Hawaiian. Oh yeah. And then he was oh, like, yeah. "I'm not gonna tell you what that means. One day I'll tell you what it means." Yeah. And, and I had to wait for him to tell me what it means. Yeah, she. Li how long? Uh, she literally had to wait until like three days. I can't, three days. That yeah. wasn't. Yeah. You told me after like three days, because I kept on bugging you about yeah. it. I'm a oh. very curious person. Oh I yeah, need that's to, right. Like, yeah. if somebody mentions something to me, I need to know exactly what it is. Yeah. I can't wait. Well, that's true. So it was me. Okay. Oh. What's the dumbest thing you've ever cried about? <sighs> that's actually... Okay, so there was this one time, right, when I was a kid, and there was a piece of gauze that I found and I hurt myself on my knee. A piece of what? Gauze. What's that? I don't know. You know like the little wrapping cottons, you know when you get like injured gauze, you know gauze? Or whatever. I don't know. Anyway, it was just a piece of gauze that I found inside of like them little packets and I opened it and I was gonna put it on my knee and then for some reason I created like this little image in my head that it was alive. And then I was torching it if I put it on my on my sore. So then I put it on my face and I was like, oh, this is so soft. And, and I started treating it like a little baby. And then I started crying. <laughs> what? Yeah. It was, I don't know, it was weird. Because I don't know, it was just something so stupid. But that was the dumbest thing I've ever cried about. I don't know why I just got emotional. You cried about what though? It dying? No, what? just because it was, I thought it was alive. And then, and then. I started thinking that everything else was alive around me, like inanimate objects and stuff. But they, can't, they just can't say anything. <laughs> you didn't. She, she never knew that. At all. She didn't know that. Okay, so. first of all, I'm gonna search up what the heck a gauze is after this video. Because I don't even know what wow. the heck that is. Wow. Okay. I'm a, I don't know. Yeah. Turn. Wasn't that the one that. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, what's the grossest thing you've ever eaten? When I was younger. Yeah. I'm pretty sure loads of people can relate to this. That's why I'm not going to be embarrassed to say it because I know loads of people do this. 
But when I was younger, I used to eat my bogeys. Yeah. Yeah, no, I never you, did that. Yeah, you did. Don't lie. I don't do that. You it's did gross. that. I feel like everybody has done that. Well, I mean, that's not really gross because that's like human nature when you're a child, you know what I mean? So you have you done eat it. anything and everything. I mean, so you have done it. Yeah, I used to put yeah. the biggest one on my nose and like do this. Okay, that's like it. too much information for you. <laughs> what the heck? Okay. Alright, like, on, okay, I'm gonna say what, what, what mine's was. Mine's, I was like, I was playing out in the yard one day when I was younger and I was laughing like, ha 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 ha. For some reason, like, just. Just cause, like, you know, when you kid, you do a lot of weird, silly things. So, I was doing that, and a black wasp flew in my mouth. And when I like, when I closed my mouth, I heard a crunch sound, like, and I didn't know what it was, cause I felt the legs like kicking around in my mouth, and it was like touching my tongue. And I spat it out, and it was like half alive when it, when I spat it out in my hand. It was just disgusting. Like it was the grossest thing I've ever eaten. So that was one. And then there was this one time my uncle brought duck over to our house and I was eating it and I didn't know that there was a fly that landed on it, that piece that I was about to eat. So when I ate the piece of duck meat, I heard crunching noise and um, I spat it out because I knew that, like when you eat duck, it don't sound like that. It don't sound like that at all. When I spat it out, there was a, there was a dead fly with guts mushed all over it. It was, it was disgusting. I threw up twice that day and I brushed my teeth about Ten times, I think after that it was just yeah, <laughs> it was gross, it was nasty. Mhm. Mm yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah, but she still kisses me even though she knows this. Babe. <laughs> she never knew this. No, I'm just kidding. She didn't know. Okay. Who All was right. your celebrity crush as a teen? As a teen. Man. Chris Breezy. Babe, what the heck? Yeah, man. Chris Brown. Oh, he was all like. Whoa. Oh no, wait, that's Trey Songs. You had a guy crush? No, I'm just kidding, I'm playing with you. I'm playing with you. I don't even know you now. Oh! What was it? Jennifer Lopez. You like J Lo? J Lo. Oh. J Lo, when she was in that one, when she started in that one movie, um, what's it called? Selena. You right. You remember that movie? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Go on your turn. You're not gonna answer that question? You want me to answer that question? Okay, if you want to. I had loads of celebrity crushes. Mind you, like, she wasn't loads. like. Loads. Yeah, go on. I was gonna what say. What was he gonna say? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. Go on, go on. Okay, back in the days, okay. I used to like T.I., Michael Ely, Choi Songs, Chris Brown, Bow Wow, like all them guys mm. that were like. Yeah, not that time, I guess. Like the younger guys. Yeah, I told you, he's breezy, man. <clears throat> he's I don't like him anymore. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what was the most embarrassing moment you ever had? Um, the most embarrassing moment I've ever had is actually so funny. Okay, I was in <laughs> primary school, and we had sports day, right? So we were doing the relay races. And we were in like our little oh, line of where everyone's sitting down. Right. And so everyone was sitting down and I was standing up in the front cheering on like, yeah, run, run. I don't remember who was running at the time. Yeah. But I remember um, one boy was like behind me, right? I remember, I'm not going to say his name, but I remember his name. And um, he was telling me to sit down because we were meant to be sitting down. <laughs> so <laughs> he pulled me down, right? So he pulled my pants. And instead of like the whole of me sitting down, just my pants like just going boop down. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> like my pants just slip down. You're right. Um, that was the most embarrassing thing. I was crying for hours. But thank God, only a few people saw me. Like obviously he saw me, and my best friend saw me, and the person behind him saw me. But that was about it. No, everyone was doing their own thing. So yeah. I'm lucky that not a lot of people saw me. But oh my god, I had like my I had a hat on, so I was like just like that with my hat down the whole time, not looking at anyone. It was so embarrassing. Oh my god. Well, I don't know how how to take that because I I just I don't even know. Most of oh okay like I don't know if mine was that bad, but because I was like oh actually it was because mine was in class. 
funny how like a lot of these things usually happen in school. In school, yeah. yeah. So I was in class one time, and I was um, in, I think I was in algebra. I was taking algebra like one, and I was I was really sleepy. Like I didn't really care what the teacher was teaching. Like I'm not saying don't, but like don't follow me because that was a bad example at the time. Um, but I was actually sleeping on my desk, and the teacher was I don't know he was talking about something. And I just put my head down like this and I just fell asleep. I don't know how long I fell asleep for, but I fell asleep. And like when I'm sleeping, I just do things. Like I don't, I don't think, you know, because I mean? you're unconscious. So there's my friend Savannah sitting behind me, right? And then I've got Justin sitting me, um, no, next to me on, on my uh, left side. And there was really nobody else I knew because I was, I was a new kid in that, because I was new there. And this was when I was in Carolina, North Carolina. I was going to White Oak High School. And um, what happened was, I farted. <laughs> <laughs> I was sleeping and I farted. What the <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't even know. I didn't know. And you know, like, when you become aware of something like that, I kind of like, I popped up like really surprised, like, oh, did I really do that? And I made like that face, like, oh, I don't really care just because, like, I don't want to be embarrassed. But the whole class, when I opened my eyes, was looking at me, directly at me. <laughs> Even the teacher was like, he had the ruler on the board and he was looking at me like this, like he paused. And everybody was just staring at me. And I looked around and I was like, I kind of like swept it off, you know, to my <laughs> what friend. The heck? And my friend, like all I hear in the background is my friend Sabana go, nice. <laughs> I was like, what the heck? So I just put my head back down, I went back to sleep. Oh and then, and then the teacher just continued doing what he was doing. Like it was just that was the most embarrassing moment that I ever had. Honestly, mm. I mean, I feel like most people won't be embarrassed by that because they don't care about it. At the time, no, obviously, I'm pretty sure a lot of people would care if they farted in public loudly. My dad don't care. Is it? My dad don't care. He don't care. I think like the elderly others, they don't care. Honestly, they really don't. Okay, I'm gonna ask you this one. Go on. Do you know how to spell anti-disestablishmentarianism? No, oh, you think you're cool because you can say anti-disestablishmentarianism? No? You can't even say it. Do you want me to repeat I just did. It? I just did. I just said it. What are you talking about? Do you want me to repeat it? Anti-disestablishmentarianism. Anti-disestablishmentarianism. That's what I just said. No, you said A-N-T-I. Dis. D-I-S. Establishment. A S T. <laughs> Establishment. <laughs> Establishment is not with an A. <laughs> oh yeah, E S T B L. Sorry, not A establishment. E establishment with an E. Okay, B L. B L anism. Ishmentarianism. Ishmentarian. I S. I S. I S. I S H. Libertarianism. Libertarianism. Okay, we'll skip that. No, skip you. Skip that. Trying to make me look foolish out here. <laughs> Trying said, to make me look foolish. You said I S though. That was funny. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I bet you don't know how to spell suicidal hyperparathyroidism. What? What? Say it again. That's what I thought. I'll Go on it. next. Go on, say next it again. question. Say it again. Pseudo pseudo hypoparathyroidism. Never mind. Ha! I see. All you right, see. Go on, you see. Turn. All right. Let's see. Okay, how about this? Because I know a lot of people do this. Comment down below if you guys do this as well. You talk to yourself in the mirror. Yeah. Why? A lot. Why? Who does that? I think the time when I'm I talk to myself in the mirror the most is when I'm crying. I when I'm crying, I literally go to the mirror. And I make myself cry even more because I see myself cry and then I get more emotional. Oh, you're so depressing. Yeah, so then I just cry. Like, look at my. I just hold this. I usually go to the toilet mirror. So I just hold the <laughs> sink and I'm just there looking at myself, crying my eyes out, making myself cry even more because of the way I'm crying. It's so dramatic. Yeah, it's very dramatic. Yeah. It's like a whole movie scene. Yeah, I don't, I don't do that. I don't think they do that in movies either. But... Yeah, they This is the end of the video guys, so if you guys did like it, go ahead and subscribe and drop a comment down below if you guys want us to do more content like this. Uh, we will be trying to upload weekly and we can just take it from there. I mean, our informations will be 
down in the link below. So if you guys want to go ahead and follow us on Instagram, send us a message, anything like that, you just want to click on the links below. All right, guys? Feel free to give us your ideas about what kind of videos you'd like yeah. us to do and stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, my Instagram already has a lot of... Um, a lot of my followers have already given me a lot of ideas, so we will be carrying on with those so and famous. stuff. No, I'm not that famous. <laughs> but I have like a special connection with my followers yeah. because it's a writing page yeah. and it has my story on it. Mm -hmm. So if you want, you can go and check out my Instagram, read my story, and if you have any questions, we can also make a video about that. Yeah. So. Alright guys. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Keep going.